Can you imagine what it would be like for a burglar to drop in and there was a tiger in the house? <laughs> okay, Sleeping it's the time for the, the special feature of What's My Line now, the appearance of our mystery guest. Are your blindfolds all in place, panel? Yes, sir. Yes. Then would our mystery guest enter and sign in, please? Two minutes. You have two minutes, panel. Fate's law prevails. We'll go one question at a time. We'll start with Arlene Francis. Thank you. Uh, mystery guest, are you best known for your appearances on television? Mm, yes. Jack? Mystery guest, because of that wonderful applause you got, could we assume that you're a star of radio? Mm. <laughs> <laughs> mm, no, I don't believe. Anita? Um, are you, do you do mostly comedy? Not on purpose. Bert? Not on purpose. Um, not on purpose. Are you a television actor? Uh, is it, a, are you in a series uh, currently running or rerunning now? Yes. Arlene? Mm -hmm. Uh, is it a dramatic series? <coughs> not really. No, not really. No. Jack? So uh, I mean, I don't think anybody established that he was an actor, but Bert just well, assumed that and pushed ahead. I Jack? Know. Could we... He's not a comedian, though. Could I, uh... Do you perhaps have a show where you are not an actor, but more a... possibly maybe a moderator? Mm-hmm. Sort of. Anita? A moderator. Is it a game show? No. Uh, Bert? Um, <laughs> yeah, I'm still here. <laughs> uh, uh, okay. What would he be? Is this a, is this a, uh, a, a daytime uh, show as opposed to a nighttime show? Mm-hmm. Oh, okay. Lean. All right, let's get going here. Is it a show that gives some kind of information, like a news show? Well, some kind, I guess, huh? What? Who, was well, that the mystery guest? Some no. kind of information. Oh, well, that was all there, Jack. Some kind of information. Mm -hmm. uh, some kind of... Well, it, well would, then, would then it be considered a service type show? Mm-hmm. It would, but unfortunately we're out of time. Oh, wait, You're wait, all wait, wait, a wait, huge wait. shot. You have one guess? Is it sports? Mm -hmm. No, I... Is oh, wait it, a minute. Is it... I know what Frank it is. Frank McGee. Is it... Joe Garziola. Is it Arlene, a... do you have something you want to say? Could you <laughs> is be... it a man that's just written a book called Wally's Workshop? Yes, it is. Wally Bruner. Wally Bruner. Wally Bruner. <laughs> Well, we thought we had you there, brother. I've been here until 1987, and that never <laughs> would have occurred to me. Really? Oh, no. uh, hey, you look great. Don't we? Don't, don't you look great? I knew you'd appreciate that, Jack. Uh, and Arlene, and he did not This Fine. is Wally's book. Everybody should see it, because it's going to be hard to get pretty soon. Everybody's going to want it. It's called Wally's Workshop. Look at that, and that's a f look for the fat guy on the cover. <laughs> that's the best way we can describe it. Now, it's a book about how to fix things around the house, right? That's right. And, and you, make things and you know, the, the greatest thing that I learned, uh, you know, I was in Washington many years as a correspondent at the White House. Yeah. And if you learn to fix things in Washington, you don't have any trouble around the home. Oh, <laughs> oh they need you now. <laughs> I don't know. The I fix was in earlier, and look what happened. May I say and congratulate you on the great job you're doing on What's My Line? Well, thank I, you, I Wally. Think, isn't he, ladies you're and gentlemen? Come back to Paul. He's really good. Listen, I'm not doing anything after the show. Let's me and you go up to Washington to see what we can do. I think it could use a little attention there. I, uh, I really do, you know. Um, uh, they, everyone says, well, gee, you know, if things happen, we're going to have Mr. Agnew. And the great line is that Mr. Agnew is really no worse than he appears. That's the great thing about it. <laughs> Don't go away, everybody. We'll be right back with more of these goodies for the American public. Don't go away. We'll be right back.